and uh, Chozo, I think. Uh, yeah. Fox 16, I had the pleasure of playing him in bracket and being uh, exploded to death by his snake. <laughs> a very wonderful time I had. Yeah. Uh, definitely a lot of fun playing against Snake. Snake is such an interesting character to play against in Smash Ultimate for the majority of us who came from a Smash 4 background because unless you played Brawl and you played Brawl competitively, then this is a whole new world for you. You have no idea what's going on. Uh, not only does he have tons of explosions that you can trade with. I'm sorry, I said Chazo. I, I, meant, I said Chozo and I meant Chazo. Chozo is the, uh, the the bird people from uh, Metroid. I'm I'm, oh, yeah, I'm yeah. looking. <laughs> I'm I'm thinking back on my Metroid Prime uh, saga research right now. But game number one, Pokemon Stadium two again, Starter Stadium. No surprise. Yep. I blinked and all of a sudden <laughs> Chazo is already at 33 percent. Oh no, uh, Fox 16 is at 33 percent. Oh yeah, the, the names are backwards. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, interesting. Here we go. Uh, of course, the, the big game for Snake is can I get my setups? And against a character like DDD, very slow, kind of leaves himself paralyzed when he tries to absorb projectiles. I feel like Snake's going to have a fun time getting the setups he needs. Yeah, absolutely. All right. Now Fox 16 going to set up the C4 on the platform. That's something you're going to want to look out for. All right, the up tilt, closing out that first stock. This is going to be so crucial. DDD, one of the heaviest characters in the game. Snake, pretty heavy himself, so he's going to survive. Uh, have a lot of survival ability, but not quite uh, going to be as useful if you're down a stock, which is not the case for Foxes. You know? yeah, I mean, Snake's one of those characters you can blink, and all of a sudden you're already down to 42%, oh, yeah. and you barely just got back from the Angel platform. 55% even. Yeah, I mean, he's doing a good job of reflecting Gordo, keeping it away from him, and just being, oh, that was a really bad position, and he's going to get that edge guard with the fair. Yeah. Fox 16 went a little bit too low on that. He's very vulnerable during that Cyclone animation. For sure. And that's going to be a tricky situation for uh, Fox 16 and Snake regardless because uh, Snake players will want to mix up their recovery by going high. But uh, DDD with the multiple jumps, he's going to be able to chase high as well. And he, Fox Six, or Chazo able to take that first stock away from Fox 16. Yep. Fox 16 just uh, got a quick Nikita on the top though, and that's going to be a pretty easy scenario to be able to get that stock. All right, dropping a grenade on the platform, making uh, it a little bit more difficult for Chazo to chase him down. Regain center stage, gets that grab nearly setting up into the C4. 101%. Oh, wow, the grenade is actually able to reflect it, too. Kind of difficult, but gets a lead trap with the down smash. Good stuff. Uh-oh, all right, only 54% on DDD right now. This is really good for Chazo. C4 is on the stage, so just a reminder of that. Okay, gonna get that grab, down throw. What's the tech chase? Not gonna be able to find anything. Tries to get the meaty Nair also to get a little bit extra damage. That Nair, when it lands, all of its hits, it does like 45 or something, Ooh. it's crazy. All right, F tilt out of shield. Gonna get a simple punish right there. That's a really quick option for Snake. I like the way Chazo got back onto the stage. Uh, jumping high to land onto Fox 16 with a back air. Uh, you, now I feel like the oh uses <laughs> spits out back to Nikita puts uh, Fox 16 off stage bad position that's gonna be the fair that takes out the stock and that's what I'm talking about man Oscar excuse me Fox 16 trying to mix up his recovery and go high knowing that if he goes low it's going to be pretty dangerous for him as well but not gonna save you from uh, characters that have multiple jumps and can. Uh, have a lot of hang time like yeah, that. Dude, I saw Chazo at the end of that match. He's like trying to hurt, hide that smirk. You can even see him. <laughs> He's trying to hide that smirk. Oh, He's yeah. having a fun time right now. I mean, I would definitely be having fun if I made a comeback like that because Fox 16 had a, a really strong start in that game, number one, and I'm honestly not even surprised to see him do so well. Uh, he does have... Um, Yoichi as a as practice for DDD players, and he's one he's one of uh, the better D DDDs in SoCal as well. But Fox 16 switching over to Ganondorf, and I will say that this isn't no bandwagon hype. He was playing Ganondorf before Nairo, <laughs> not before Nairo, but before Nairo beat Light. The right, right, first right. three. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, but I like the pick too on Smashville. Okay, interesting. I'm tell uh, I like the pick on Smashville. It's a very enclosed space, and it's able to use Ganondorf to apply pressure and put him in bad scenarios where you can get scared, you can get catched by these long, um, curving up up airs among other different aerials that just do so much damage. Yeah. Okay, does the guy get the throw? Up throw. Get some control positioning off of that. Uh, just misspaces it. 
Chaso doing an amazing job of keeping control of his jumps and knows how to space around whatever Fox is trying to chase with. Yeah, this matchup, honestly, like, if you're asking me, it seems like a lot rougher than it would have been with a snake matchup. Oh, no. No. Not like this. That's one of those scenarios where you're both DI'ing and trying to mash out of the inhale. That's not going to work, and that's unfortunate, too. Wow. Uh, oh, that's, that's a lot of. Oh, oh, wow. Hell, oh, okay. oh, at the Gordo, I don't think Chazo took any percent on that second stock. Oh, no! <laughs> and the suicide. <gasps> no! Fox 16 made it back. Oh, how did he make it back? He flame choked. <laughs> Uh, DDD and was able to get a second flame choke to make it back, dude, oh and kill him off the God. side. All okay. right, I looked, I looked down. Now he's got to win. Already. Now yeah. he's got to win, man. Now he's got to win. Yeah, he he, he won <laughs> our hearts with that. He's got We got to bring oh, it to no. game three already. <laughs> All right, neutral air. That's gonna be a good tool to send uh, the Gordos back since it stays out for such a long time and it's uh, has a pretty large hitbox. Oh, I think Fox is trying to get a twitch clip at this he point. Is, basically. He is. Yeah. He got already? one. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> he hit back the Gordo, but it's just not in the right position for it. I feel like in general, just Snake would have been a better pick to. Ooh! <laughs> Snake would have been a better pick to keep away the Gordos, only because Dash Tech is intangible on your head and arms, so you would be able to trade with the Gordo and not take any damage from it. But I mean, Fox 16 is trying to make this Ganondorf work still. All right, he gets a grab back here on Shield. Not gonna be safe. <laughs> He's teabagging at the ledge. Cause why not? <laughs> <Man>. <laughs> He's except Oh, the armor's through! <laughs> oh, no, dude. Forward throw, Chazo putting him in a really precarious situation and jumping off of that forward air. He's gonna get the 2-0. I mean, <laughs> they're having fun. <laughs>